In OneKey, there are several kinds of inventory reports you can generate to help you manage your tools and equipment, places, and people with increased visibility and greater efficiency. In this video, we'll show you how to create inventory reports. From the inventory page, tap the download report button in the upper right corner. This will auto-download an Excel file of your entire inventory. Open the file now. This file will show you all of your inventory items information you've stored within the OneKey app. Now go back to the app. To the left of your inventory, select specific filters now to narrow down your items. If you want to report only items that need service, select Need Service now in your filters. Then select the Download Report button to auto-download your Excel file. You can also select other filters, such as Places, if you want a report of items at a specific place. Status, if you want a report of items only with a specific status, such as Items Available. People, if you want a report of items assigned to a specific crew member. Division, if you want a report of items assigned to a specific division. Manufacturers, if you want a report of items made by a specific brand. Category, if you want a report on a specific type of item. You can even choose to create a report on all wonky and or ticked items. You also have the option to select multiple filters at once to narrow your reports down even further. Once you've selected your filters, tap the blue Update button below your filter options. This will give you a new inventory list based on your filter choices. Select the Download Report button to auto-download your Excel file. Open the file now. This file will show you all of your filtered inventory items information you have stored within the Wonky app. Now go back to the app and clear out your filters. From the navigation bar, select People. Choose the crew member you wish to run an inventory report on. In the upper right corner, tap the Inventory button if you wish to download the report. Now, let's go to Places. Choose the place you wish to run an inventory report on. In the upper right corner, tap the Inventory button if you wish to download the report. An auto-download of your report will begin. Open the file now. This will be a list of info on all the items you currently have assigned to this place. You now know how to create multiple inventory reports for your records. For more helpful tips like this, please subscribe below and click on another video to keep watching.